Although the world will tell you differently, you know there's only two groups of people, the saved and the unsaved. You either belong to Jesus or you belong to Satan. Jesus calls the saved people in the Bible citizens of heaven, and he calls the unsaved people earth dwellers. Look at Revelation 3.10. The citizens of heaven, the saved people, will be kept from the hour of trial that is coming on the whole world to try those who dwell on the earth or the unsaved. Look at John 14, 2 and 3. Jesus tells us, In my Father's house are many rooms. If it were not so, would I have told you that? I go to prepare a place for you. And if I go and prepare a place for you, I will come again and will take you to myself that where I am you may be also. This is one of the verses that convinces me of the rapture. Why would Jesus find it necessary to prepare a place and say, I will come and take you to me if we weren't supposed to be somewhere for a period of time? When Jesus goes to come back for the second coming, we will come back with him to this earth for the battle of Armageddon. And guess what? Jesus wins. But you might ask, well, why is Satan continuing on with his plan if he already knows the plan? Which he does. He knows the Bible and so do his demons. He's doing it so he can take as many of you with him as possible. Immediately following the battle of Armageddon will be the millennial reign of Christ. And Satan will be bound for a thousand years. So we will be on this earth with Jesus so why would we need to go back up to heaven to come back down? Does that make sense? The final judgment for Satan and all of the unsaved being thrown into hell or the lake of fire will take place after that. And then Jesus will set up the new heavens and the new earth here. And we will live in our glorified bodies. We will have flesh. We will run and jump and play and enjoy life as it was meant to be sin free. Won't you trust in Jesus today? Look in the Bible, see his plan of salvation. He loves you so much. He's waiting for you. Don't go with Satan. Go with Jesus. He wins.